Hey y'all, this is Gloria coming to you on Tuesday, August the 12th. Uh, not a lot of changes going on um, as a vet. You know, right now I'm just, you know, feel like I'm juggling my numbers to keep my weight, um, you know, around 225. And sometimes 224, 226, it's, you know, it's almost like an everyday battle. Uh, I had started going back to the gym, but I haven't got to go uh, the last couple of days. Uh, today, waiting on a repairman, which, you know, hopefully he'll be here before noon. Uh, yesterday, I was fixing to go, and my little girl had uh, fell at school and chipped a tooth. But that turned out okay. She, uh, it was just barely a little chip, and all the dentist did was um, file it down. As you can tell, my hair has absolutely got a mind of its own. You know, I'm on the biotin now, and I hadn't colored it. That's why you see all the gray, which I'm kind of liking the gray a little. But, um, you know, it, it just got so curly. And, you know, I've always wanted curly hair. But, uh, you know, I hadn't been blow drying it uh, like I was because of it, um, you know, falling out so bad, looking so dry. And I've got a second shoulder here. But um, <clears throat> anyway, you know, just kind of enjoying that. Yeah, you know, I've been uh, thinking a lot on the journey that I've been on. And it just, I feel like, you know, total disbelief, really. I never imagined myself being here. I know I keep saying that over and over, but, you know, I just, um, it just seems so unreal. I'm very happy uh, where I'm at. Um, you know, I wouldn't mind losing a little bit more, but if I don't, you know what? I'm not going to sweat it. it and, you have got to the point, it's not all about the numbers. It is about how you feel. And I feel pretty good. I mean, you know, I still have the uh, aches and pains, but, you know, in a few weeks, I'll be 51 years old. So, you know, kind of uh, climbing on up there, which I know there's people a lot older that's a lot more spry than I am, like my uh, mother-in-law. She's 70. And uh, she'll be 71 in November. And it's unbelievable. I mean, she gets around good. You know, she don't have a lot of aches and pains. She just stays a little grumpy. But, um, you know, that's just, I think, her enjoyment. Her and my uh, father-in-law kind of going back and forth. But it's kind of funny in a way. Um, I'm trying to think of anything else going on. I know... Um, I got him a package yesterday from Maintaining Michelle. Um, if you're not one of her subscribers, you got to check her out. Uh, I know she's, I don't know if she's doing uh, very many YouTube videos because I don't get on YouTube a whole lot anymore. I just, um, I just don't take the time to be honest. I wish I did because I have made numerous friends on YouTube. Uh, right now, most time I see him is uh, on Facebook, and um, you know I, I enjoy all the people I've met. Um, there's like uh, Fat Guy Skinny Wallet, uh, Maintaining Michelle, Belinda Ball, um, beautiful Alicia, uh, and she has really come a long way on her journey. And I can't say enough about her motivation, her enthusiasm. You know, we all get to the point, I think we just relax. And then, you know, that uh, enthusiasm, that go get them attitude hits us again. And, you know, that's awesome. Um, and, you know, something else, too, I, I think I was telling you about me seeing the bariatrician uh, last week, and all my numbers finally come in on my vitamins, and the only vitamin I'm getting low on is, I think a B6, 
but everything else is good and I have to stop my B12 shots for a little while because I'm getting uh, too much in my system so I don't know I you know I need to um, get back on my vitamins which I've been taking them and getting back to drinking my water and God knows I have enough coffee this cup I show up like this because before it well you know what that is a big cut from here that angle my god that thing looks almost big as my head don't it but it's good though <sighs> love my coffee that's my new addiction i tell everybody my coffee um what else you know what i wish all you guys and girls that sounds kind of funny i'd call everybody guys i wish all of my friends uh youtube and stuff you know just come and have a cup of coffee with them. let's just sit down and chew the fat <laughs> yeah it's a pun but uh let's sit down talk about just whatever i enjoy talking to people and uh spend a lot of time alone uh me and the two dogs are um here alone let me show you the two puppies boo boo say hi to everybody say hi boo boo zacky zach Raise your head up, boy. Well, I guess you saw Boo Boo. Uh, come here, Boo Boo. Come here. Now, Zach. Come here, Zachy. Say hi to everybody. This is the most lovable and sweetest little fella. Look at him. You're a baby doll, ain't you? Give me sugars. Watch this, y'all. He's just so funny. Give me sugars. Give me sugars. He won't give you sugars, but he'll reach around for you to kiss his cheek. He's funny. He's going back over to lay down Boo-Boo. Him Boo-Boo's got really tight. Uh, it's kind of funny, you know, them being strangers. When I came here eight months ago, almost nine months ago. Oh, it's been nine months. And uh, they just took up with each other like these brothers. But, <laughs> Zachy. Well, the dogs are barking. Uh, they must be seen. Shh, shh, shh. Um, but anyway, that's it for today. I will uh, contact you again and apologize for the dogs barking. Okay, y'all have an awesome day, and I will holler at you later. Love you. Bye.